Okay, today I'm gonna be doing an unboxing and a review of the Fifine, I don't know how you pronounce it, Fifine, Fifine, uh, Fifine uh, wireless lavalier system. So the official name is the uh, Fifine 20 channel UHF wireless lavalier lapel microphone system with body pack transmitter. So here we go. Okay, all right, so we got the five fine, fa fine, who knows? We got the five fine box here. All right. Inside, we've got some pamphlets. Great, some of this stuff. Okay, so here's the transmitter pack. Um, it's kind of big. So here's the, uh, here's an iPhone 6, there's my baby. Um, but here's an iPhone 6 for comparison. So, kind of chunky. Um, we've got the lapel, got some more foam. Got the lapel mic itself. Again, this thing's kind of, kind of beefy. Uh, all right, I don't know, here it's compared to a, an iPhone watch. Um, it's kind of chunky in comparison to maybe other lav layers. Maybe I'm spoiled because we have some more expensive lavs at the church. Okay, so here's the, uh, like the receiver. So normally on like a wireless system, you'd have like a whole receiver unit and everything. This is just like literally a little TRS or quarter inch plug-in receiver. So, all right, we got some batteries here. So yeah. Okay. So I'm not really going to give you like the super technical uh, review. This is going to be like just a user review because um, this thing's like 30 bucks. Okay. So if you're like a super big audio engineer or whatever, uh, you're turning your nose up at this thing anyways, you're not buying this. So people that are buying this are people like me, you just, you know, want a, a live mic, you want it wireless and you know, you want to see if it works. Um, so let's see. Okay. So got it all plugged in, got the transmitter plugged in turned on so this thing's got a little antenna here all right so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna plug this i got my uh zoom h4 inch right now i've got a zoom h4 inch running up to my boom mic so i'm gonna plug this into the zoom check 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 okay so uh i'm gonna switch over to the um audio from this now. Okay, so now you're hearing the audio from this. Looks like my level's a little high peaking, so let me pull this down. Uh, okay, yeah, that was set on 80, so let me pull it down to match. Okay. Um, so on my Zoom H4n, I had the audio level for my um, boom mic set to 35, and now the a fine live is set to the same. So let me see. This would be sorry. I mean, this would be run like this. Whoop. All right. So t-shirts are not the best application for this. Okay. So this is like um, you know it's pointed sideways. So again, maybe not the best way uh, to do this, but you know it is one way. So again, I'll show you. Just got it kind of pointed, kind of angled. I mean, um, it's not great. So this is my, I don't want to say normal setup because I don't, I'm normally kind of lazy and I don't do tons of uh, audio. I just run and gun with my camera, but I've got the little boom rack right here going into this Zoom H4n. So that's where the audio for the rest of this video is coming from. So yeah, the audio level looks pretty good. I was, it's, it's similar. I'm getting a similar audio output just by looking at level. Obviously I can't hear it, but just by looking at the output, it looks the same as what I'm getting from the, um, boom mic. We'll see how it sounds. I'll listen and post, maybe post a little more, uh, after I've listened back in my application of this. So if I'm doing drum videos, you may have seen this, um, for my channel, the difficult thing I have is my, my angles and my, uh, you know, cameras are set so far away that it's hard to get a boom mic. I don't like holding a mic. I don't like having a mic in my face necessarily. 
Um, and so it's hard to get really good vocal audio. So I thought a live would be great, but I didn't really want to do like a, the phone thing. I wanted something that I could plug into an interface or um, whatever, but I didn't want to spend 300 bucks or you know 500 bucks just because I didn't care that much. So this is kind of what I came up with. So for 30 bucks, I mean, I'm getting a level out of it. I have no idea how it sounds yet, but we'll see. Um, but for 30 bucks, it seems like it's working so far. Um, the other thing is, I guess, um, length distance away, which again, for me is not as big of a deal because you know, I'm gonna be using it pretty close, but for some of you, it may be, so just for the sake of it, let's see what we can do. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go outside into my backyard here, and I'm gonna see how far you can uh, hear me. So here we go. Okay, I'm outside now, testing, testing, and the ground is wet. I should have put on shoes. I'm not sure if you can still hear me. Uh, I'm not gonna gauge exactly how far this is, but uh, it's a good little distance. So um, again, maybe if you're, you know, I don't know what you could be using this for, but you know, wirelessly, if you're using this for like your church, for your main thing. Again, what's interesting to me is, uh, you know, you probably wanna look at this for like your church or some main thing where you really need it, because again, it's 30 bucks. So if you desperately need it, you gotta have it, you know, um, it's gotta work, it's gotta be super reliable. You know, 30 bucks probably not your answer, but uh, for me, so we'll see. I'm gonna keep walking. So I'm gonna probably be get out of frame here in a second. Uh, corner of my yard, so farther away. If I had a cameraman, I could spin this camera. You could see. Um, but yeah, we'll see. Again, the unit is a little chunky. Um, the actual mic itself, so I may use it without the little windscreen, but. I mean, it's working and I'm getting decent levels out of it. So, um, so far, so good. Okay, so I dropped the audio into Logic and just listening back um, really quickly. Um, obviously, the fullness is not the same as uh, my boom mic, but again, that's what you're gonna get out of a, a lav mic is a little bit less uh, response uh, range in general. So, although it's just a first impression review, I've only had it for literally a grand total of 30 minutes. For 30 bucks, I mean, it works. What else can you really ask of it, you know? Um, so I'm gonna use it for my videos and see what I think. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty impressed uh, with the fact that it just gives clean audio. Um, you know, we'll see a little bit later on. I may have a, a follow-up review. But I would say, man, if you're looking for a, a wireless um, live option, but you know, you're not really worried about um, it being the most amazing thing ever, check it out. Um, so yeah, we'll see. I just got done editing all the footage, but I realized that I forgot to say thank you. My mom would be so mad at me, so thanks for watching. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. I'd love for you to follow along, um, get you know notified when new content drops. Also, like this video, share it if there's someone that you feel like would benefit from it. Um, don't forget, I also have links to just a bunch of stuff like this, including this, um, in the description. Uh, I'm a drummer first and kind of a videographer, like second, third, fourth, fifth, like way down the line. So I try to find ways to do stuff on the cheap. So I've got cheap lights, uh, cheap audio recording stuff. Again, stuff that is inexpensive, but yet really works for my purposes. Um, so I've also got a bunch of great drum stuff, a great iPhone microphone um, that I use to record. Just a lot of great stuff, so check that out. Um, there's links to everything in the description. Um, this channel was really started as a way to inspire, uh, to equip, to help people to share some of my stuff. So I've got tons of things on here from drum videos to vlogs to lessons, drum lessons to tech reviews and all kinds of stuff. So, uh, man, help me out. Share this with somebody. Help me expand this network and help more people. That's how you can help me help others. Thanks.